Thank you for letting me tune in. This is the Coronado Arte Harris Show, owner of the global markets and the spanker of your annuity. And please bring the women out. This is Fox Business, not CNN with Colbert. Why are you acting like Mr. Andy Anderson and Tim Kiki? This is Fox Business News Live, featured in my show, the Coronado Arte Harris Show. I don't know if Global Market Majority take over of all 10 year, 15 year, 30 year corporate, private, and public accounts. Stocks, bonds, mutual funds, and majority stakeholder of all currencies on the Forex Exchange because I own the Forex Exchange. See what your tail has to tell. Use down there at TJ Maxx. You seen how nice Coronado was doing with his portfolio. So you found a way to liquidate his. His, you liquidated your assets, didn't you? And because your your assets liquidated, you got mad about it. And before he makes it, and a real woman finds him, we're gonna crash his wedding. Okay. Thank you for letting me tune in, because this is inside the door technologies, and you, you, Liz Claiborne. You Lane Bryant, you're you're you you just a little bit too little. You're a pony. You can't wear Lane Bryant. You can't wear it. And it's not for you. You know what I'm saying? You know what I'm saying? I'll talk to you later. Bye. This is an all beige party, okay? Get out of here, I'm not Jewish anymore. I'm not from Amelia. I'm a white girl now. No! You're not a white girl, you're a beige girl. I'm a white girl, not not a fox, not a possum. I'm a white girl and I hate your guts. And I want you to get out of here because you caught us stealing your money from the bank. And we're not going to put up with it. Don't I look like Betty White? You do look like a possum a little bit, I tell you. You look like you could work for Glovis, yes. And the Montgomery Boys Court. <laughs> and the fucking Greyhound down there, Tallapussy. Look how much you lost yesterday. You had to liquidate the Bitcoin because you can't speak for Steve. Steve speaks from candy. He sp he speaks from candy. Forgive him. He's a G, right? Uh, no. But he does speak from a jar of candy. Can we can we agree to that? It's not his fault that he's learning. Another step for the learning tree. It's not Joe's fault that he's made more mistakes than any president at the same time in history? <laughs> no, this is better wrong. This is the better wrong show. This is the I'm gonna meet you down at, at, at UPS Park. And I'm gonna meet you there and put that banjo on your knee and hit you in your mouth. With some Colgate, cause your breath stank. Thank you for letting me do that. How much money that they are stealing from my cryptocurrency because I made money. Okay. It could have still been goddamn in good territory. These possums and raccoons are just that rampant. When they see money, they hit the panic button. Get out of my house and don't come back. Hey, we're supposed to be celebrating and party. I made a lot of money. No, you need to get your stuff and get out of my house. Because you made, Coronado made money and we didn't. This is going to be a problem, okay? And everybody else is like, why? Call Jerry Springer. Call Ricky Lake. Call Steve Wilco. Call WWE. Call MMA Fight. Call the Rifle Association. Because this Negro has more money than we bargained for. Is that the only thing that he did wrong? No. He, he talked to a beautiful woman. The most beautiful woman he ever seen. Gorgeous. I mean, flawless. You know what I'm saying? If you're not doing it like this, you're not doing anything if you're not doing it like this. This is the laptop of Cam Newton. This is the cell phone that the woman that works at Walmart stole right on camera and got away with it. And is still employed at Walmart. Well, we're concerned about your safety and your wireless speakers.